The water brings countless people together for many reasons, one of which is to paddle in a dragon boat. The team spirit is alive in Qatar, with the Doha Wireless Warriors coming together to be a community builder. The first to introduce the dragon boat culture in Qatar for this team with the aim to bring together cancer survivors and supporters to live an active life. It provides a safe space for survivors to simply be without feeling the need to talk about their diagnosis. A lot of our team members are either cancer survivors or cancer supporters, had some close person to them, have cancer, passed or survived. And um, that is a traumatizing experience. You need a lot of uh, emotional support and just to get, get through the day. So if we make it about competition and winning, uh, we lose our purpose. Our team is a community builder, so we focus not as a competitive team. We go ahead and compete in the championships and in the races, but actually we are a community builder and we paddle for life and we paddle for a great cause. So among the team, you have survivors and I'm one of them. I'm feeling proud. I crossed my six months uh, milestone of uh, cancer survivor and we are paddling just to give a message to everyone. You know what? Even if you have it, you can be a strong one. The importance of the community mind is also to bring everyone together in an expat community where many are away from home. Qatar has 2.7 million people with only 350,000 Qataris. Everyone else from different families, communities, nationalities. Sometimes we have 22 nationalities in the boat. So if you are in the boat, they, you, you miss your family, you miss your friends, you miss your lifestyle, you miss your culture, and you don't have that community. So here, like I come from the office today, today one of hardest day at work. But when I come in the boat, it's different dynamic because I have the people who I really know that they love and even if I shout and I become crazy as a coach, they will beer me and they will have fun. So it's, it's creating the community because actually as an expat here, we need it. We, need, we, we don't have our family, so our family is here. It's social as well and it's a way to integrate into the community and also to share with different nationalities. You know, I love the diversity of the group. Bev has been in Qatar for nine months, originally from South Africa, but now a citizen of the UK. Her forte wasn't in the water, but that didn't hold her back. And since joining the team, the fun they have has brought her strength and confidence in the boat. I love the water and I just watch them in the dragon boat and they were having such a lot of fun. And I just said to my husband, that's what I want to do. And he looked at me as, but you can't swim. And uh, a friend at work in, um, invited me along a couple of months ago in February actually and I said but I can't swim and they said you don't have to swim so I said I'm there the best fun and the best way to relax at the end of the day um, my job is fairly stressful and um, it's a wonderful way to unwind and these beautiful people that we in the boat with they just uplift you and it's just a great place to to spend your time when you come you think oh, I really don't have the energy, but as soon as you're in the boat and you feel the energy and then you just keep going and the people motivate you, they encourage you. Yeah, we do compete, but we don't aim to win. We just want to tell people we're here and cancer survivors are here and, and they're active and, and they're enjoying life and that could be you. You could also enjoy life. We're not a competitive team, however, we went to Egypt and we got third, we went to Canada and we got number one for the ladies race, but we are a people who believe that we need to live a better lifestyle. We support each other as a community, we are not that fantastic competitive winner team, but we are a team who believe in a greater lifestyle and sportive life. And we are happy like that way, that's why we have rule number one. Have fun! Have fun! Have fun! Have fun. <laughs> <laughs>